Will's achievement is phenomenal. Uh, I think what you did, uh, what you saw last uh, Monday with Kev, and a lot of people won't know that, that Finn has did, uh, I think, around 70k with him. Is that right? Um, on top of everything, he's done 21k's every day for a month. Uh, he's a remarkable man, uh, all out of trying to show his way of supporting. Um, and as he just mentioned to the group, it's not just him. It's He obviously has is, is done a huge amount, uh, but staff members running with him, players running with him, because it's the only way for, for guys to probably show their support to, uh, to Tiff Tom and the family. And uh, we've been blown away by what they've done and by everyone participating and um, pulling their bit and doing their bit to support us. So we're hugely grateful. And I think uh, Will is... Um, it's sort of really shown um, mind over matter and, he, and he's, he's put his body through the mill uh, but he's done it and he, and he wants to carry on doing it so good on him uh, to our family it means a huge amount as I mentioned uh, for someone to to come up with a with an idea of raising money for a, for charity of Tiff and Tom's choice to then go right I'm gonna I'm gonna do something that's that's gonna be unbelievably challenging uh, and then go out and do it uh, is incredible you know because a lot of people forget he's, he's also working like he's doing his job as well as doing that so it's uh, he's still doing everything he, he's supposed to do during the day and fitting in these these runs and to do it every day for a month has been amazing i think what he's probably been blown away by as i have in the family is just how many other people have um put their running trainers on for the first time just try to do something you know whether they've done 12k or 21 with him or even just five it didn't matter it was about participating and showing their way of supporting the family and getting involved um and i just absolutely tip my hat off to him uh i ran with freddie stewart uh sal uh, myself, uh, even Ed Moe, uh, the groundsman here, who he hasn't ran for years, uh, he, he, we managed to do 12k. Uh, it's a phenomenal feat. So, uh, and we got around. And, and Will, to be fair, was pretty banged up at that point. Um, but uh, I think he's only ran on his own one day out of the month. I mean, that that shows it. You know, for uh, for a whole month, only one time has he ever ran on his own. The rest of the time, he's had constant support. And as I said, it just shows that people it's their way of um, showing support. So, thank you. To the message to everyone that's um, either donated, supported, ran with Will, got in touch, sent messages, just thank you, thank you. Um, you know, there's good days, there's bad days, but uh, when people galvanise you and get around you, um, it can turn a bad day into a good day. So thank you very much for your support and please continue to support because uh, we need it and it goes a long way. Thank you. My challenge is done, but you know, the family, they still need our help, they need our support, so we'll carry on going, and obviously the running will stop, but we've got a few things lined up like, for the end. Um, we'll keep the support alive for the young's family, because you know, they're an incredible, incredible family, and you know, this, is the, this is the least we could do, but yeah, I really appreciate, appreciate your boys coming out today. So. Yes, yeah. it, was, it was a bit different today, I think, um, knowing I had one left, it was one of them where you know, the months have been going on for quite a while and I've slowly been ticking them off. And even when I had sort of three or four left, it was still, I've still got a long way to go. Whereas I woke up today and it, yeah, a bit of reality hit that once I'd finished today, it was, the challenge was over. And um, yeah, I hadn't told anyone that I was going to do the full marathon today. Um, so again, that was quite, well, it was tough, but it was quite special to finish knowing that I'd maybe done a little bit extra as well. Yeah, that was special. And um like my grandparents, you know, the club have helped me get them down here today. Mum and dad, sister came as well, which, which is nice, you know, because these are, these are moments that I'm yeah, probably never going to have ever again. So to have them here to experience it, um, and they've had a great day. You know, the players, staff have spoken with them and they felt very much a part of the club. So, um, yeah, I'm very grateful for the club for that. But to have them down was great. And then to run a little bit further through and, and be meted by the players, um, be greeted by the players, sorry, was, um, yeah, it was incredibly special because, you know, those guys and, and the staff as well have, have hugely helped me this, this month, um, both with, you know, helping me workload, but also keeping me going. Um, messages, having them guys on the bike or running a little bit with me. Um, and I think what's been a nice thing is actually is the whole club's come together, you know, to, to get behind, maybe get behind me running, but more importantly, get behind the Youngs family. Today's probably, again, was a similar to feeling, similar feeling to how I felt running with Kev. Um, you know you've got a long, long way to go and you're hurting, you know, your body's hurting, your mind's telling you to stop. But then you think about why you're doing it, you think of the family, you think about the people you're going to see at the finish line and you go, oh, I can carry on going through this pain for a couple more hours. Um, but in terms of the whole month, yeah, it's been it's been pretty it has been pretty emotional at times, and I've tried to do my best not to cover it, but you know, not get too immersed in it, and just sort of 
go with the flow, um, you know, take each day as it comes. And yeah, look, we're here on day 30. We've had a great reception at the, at the end. And um, like I said to the lads, you know, my challenge might have finished. Um, but, you know, there's still a family out there that needs our support. And um, we're going to hopefully you know, continue to give that. I can't go and thank everyone that's donated as much as I'd love to. Um, but if you have donated, you know, thank you. And, you know, let's, let's keep going. Let's keep sharing it. And let's keep, let's keep growing it. Because like I said, just because the challenge finished doesn't mean we can't continue that support. So, um, yeah, the message would be a big, big thank you. But, yeah, we're not going to finish it there. Like, don't understand how much it helps us. Like this sort of thing, you boys win in the weekend. Even if you don't win, the way you're playing, are unbelievable in it together. It helps us so much. Um, we're in a shit time at the moment. We're, we're, we're every day is a battle. And we're getting through in it, and you know we get to go to bed at night. And so, yeah, today was a good day. Well, today was a shit day um, at the moment, and today at the moment we're having good days. And um, things like you've done well, unbelievable. And uh, the way you boys have helped us, texted me, spoke to me. I can't thank you enough. Um, it, it means a lot and it helps a hell of a lot, so I really appreciate it. First of all, coming back up here is, is brilliant and um, to see the boys, coaching staff, backroom staff, you guys, um, it's, it's lovely um, and um, obviously been away for a bit now, so nice to come back and, and to see Finners run in, stupid bloke run a marathon um, and see him run in and finish it. Um, was great and, it, and I just wanted to come up and, and say thanks in person to everyone um, and obviously I'd like to reach out to the, the wider community fans and the rugby community and say thank you for the support you've, you've given us over the, over the time recently and, and um, it, it helps a lot. I just said, um, you know, it, you, I can't tell you how much it means to us to, as I said, like it's not even the way they've... The, the winning's great, but the way they've been going about it, I just it's just they look tight knit group, a team, and it just it's helped me and Tiff no end. Um, the way you know Wills took this challenge on, the support is huge for us, and it's special, and, and it and it really does help us, you know, take another step forward. And and what I said was that Tiff's in a really good spot at the moment, and what I said is that when we go to bed at night now, we we look at each other and say today's been a good day, um, and long that long that may continue for as long as possible um, and, and um, we've had some tough days and but we take each day as it comes and you know with a Saturday and watch a game or with Finners running every day it gave us something to, to look at and, and talk about. Um, we, we've had some um, pretty ropey, ropey days um, along the way so far but the last couple of weeks have been fantastic um, and um, yeah they're happy how things are going and, and uh, hopefully that will continue as, for as long as possible um, we're positive about it and we will keep you know my wife's an incredible incredible lady and, and she's extremely tough and um, resilient and, and uh, what everyone will say to her that oh this will you know be this or that she'll t go away from it and, and uh, be determined to be here you know all stronger and better and and keep going and, and she keeps turning up every day and um and she's a she's brilliant and she's been fantastic for this whole thing